Good morning, FS Club. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to FS Daily News. Day three with no testing list. Seriously, have no clue how we are going to survive without this list. Anyways, we got some good news to go over today, like a mapper that is coming back to mapping, which is a big one. Plus, Tactical Farmer has some news on his John Deere 1025E pack. And like I said, no testing list, it is still not here. Remember, before we get to the news, make sure to hit the like button, smack that sub button, and ring that bell. Now, roll that intro, and let's go. Round around the world we'll go, putting on the greatest show. So make sure that you don't miss out, just be Welcome back. Okay, so here we go with that first piece of news for today. It's from Mac Trucker 921 He got the latest list of issues he needs to fix for his case and his large shovel update. The shovel is pretty easy and he's already resubmitted it back this morning. Surprisingly enough, it's showing his testing complete already. So don't know what's going on with that. The case took a bit more doing because it had a longer list of issues, including the dreaded not enough features line. But they said if he animates something on the tractor, that will be sufficient. So he animated the steering wheel column to tilt up and down when you enter and leave the tractor. Hopefully that will be it and it'll get posted soon. And then in the meantime, he's been doing a little bit of testing. He actually tested what can this thing actually lift? Well, he's messing around and he thought, I wonder if I could lift the service truck. Remember the service truck he's gonna be coming out with? Well, short answer is yes. Is If the shop is closed and there's no one to open the gate, well, guess what? This case can lift you over that gate. Wow, very powerful tractor. Okay, now onto the next piece of news, which is from the North Modding Company, introducing a new brand for FS22. The FTG Mojada, I think that's how you say that, and their largest powered forestry trailer, the M151 four wheel drive with 15 ton load capacity and the Mojada's largest crane, the M81DT, which reaches up to 9.4 meters and lift up to 500 kg at max reach. Customized with different load spaces, toolbox, hydraulic tank for use with tractor PTO, and winch options. Remember, you have to own the Platinum DLC for that one. Plus, choose between the M81DT and the M81T crane configurations. It is still a work in progress. Pretty sure this is going to be coming out to all platforms. And the next piece of news is about a mapper that is coming back. TNT Modding is coming back, if you guys don't remember him from FS19. But anyways, his first order of business in coming back will be getting Bucks County PA converted over to FS22. I love that map. He'll be working on it as much as he can. Please be patient with him as he has to relearn everything and try to figure out the new game dynamics. It will keep everyone updated as I go. I cannot wait for uh, Bucks County PA. It was one of my favorite maps on FS19. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys played Bucks County and what you guys think of it. Okay, let's get to that last piece of news for today. And that last piece of news is from the Tactical Farmer. Update about his John Deere 1025E pack. Remember, this mod is a work in progress. There's still no release date or anything for this. Remember, it is planned for all platforms. In his last update, he told everybody he'll be working on creating some front loader attachments and improving others. So here's what he's got so far. He's completely redid the snow plow. He's very happy with it, minus needing minor details and hoses. Loader forks are gonna get some slight detail improvements. He's also added a bail spike and he's currently hard at work on the highly requested log grab. So can't wait for this to get done. This pack looks like a very good pack. Well, right there was all the news for today. Hopefully before the end of this week, we see that testing list. I also have a feeling we're going to be seeing a DLC announcement very soon. Remember, all the links to the news are linked in the description. Also, keep in mind that mods and maps never have release date unless it is scheduled. Don't forget to smash that like button if you did enjoy the video. Also, don't forget to hit that sub button to stay up to date with everything that's going on in Farming Simulator. And make sure that notification bell is on so you don't miss any of the videos here on the channel. Hope you have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Stumbling out of bed and I still got you in my head from all those pretty words you said. It's like I'm wasted. Every time I see your face, I'm losing track of time and space. I don't know where I am. It's like I'm wasted. And I won't waste it. And I promise that I